Hi and welcome to my channel. Obviously, we're gonna know that we're doing a beauty video today because one of my eyes is done. Anyway, I'd like to say Happy New Year to everybody who comes back to watch my channel and thank you for still being here even though my videos have not been coming out as regular as I'd like them to. Also, if you hear any screaming, it's just my kids. I might have to pause the video at some points and just gonna make sure they're not killing each other. But, you know, that's kids for you anyway. So, so I'm, I usually get certain brands of makeup and for Christmas, I wanted to try something a little bit different, more affordable and just, just to see exactly what it's like. So I got this one, you know, one of the new, it's the EYN Bright Matte Palette from Beauty Bay, their own brand, you get a mirror in it too. But these are the colors. Wow, really? Losing focus right now? I mean, the pigments, I mean, I know everyone's like, when you do these kind of swatches, they're never 100%. It's always all based on what the eye looks like and how it works on your eye. But, you know, just to give you like a little, the stain in my fingers. But yeah, they're really bright. So let's just give it a go. Oh, my kids just love to call the noise and Christmas has been really, really fun, to say the least. I've got a big, massive zit on my face. <sighs> anyway, let's just get on with it. So, the first thing I'm going to do, as always, is I'm going to prep my eye with concealer because, you know, making your colours pop, it's better that way. So, this is just going to go all over my lid and right up to my eyebrow. I don't tend to, obviously, go over my eyebrow. <laughs> I like to leave it some shape so I can see where I'm going on this. I was actually going to cheat and then um, use a couple of other colours with that palette because I was like thinking, how am I supposed to make a look out of that? Like some of the colours, like they're all bright and... Oh dear. Apparently my son can't turn the Xbox on. <laughs> He can't turn the Xbox on, so he's going to scream like he's being murdered. That's kids for you, right? Or was it just mine? Oh, well. Anyway, <laughs> we're going to start off with this shade here. It is called Pinky Promise. And we're going to use this brush. Like, um, this is a Luxe, a luxe Crease brush. Luxe Crease brush. Crease brush. Mm. But it's kind of fluffy. So we're going to go in. I mean, I'm, I'm going to do it underneath my eye, I think. But also because I've got a zit. I thought I could do a full face makeup video. Because um, I don't tend to do the whole contouring like I used to do. Like I used to go a bit crazy with it. And I think I used to put too much and it. it looked over the top and made me look totally different. And not like me. So I've gone for like more subtle makeup. Still don't always use it, but it's still subtle. Let's just hope I can remember to do this eye. Oh, we're gonna have two eyes looking different. Crazy. But I've been thinking about things I wanna do with this channel and hello. And um, I really wanna, cause I'm into fitness and like bodybuilding and all that. I really wanna get like doing some fitness videos as well. So I was going to try, and I've been rubbish with my channel, so you're most probably thinking like, try, mm, yeah, we'll see you in once a month. But I'm going to try and do like a makeup video once a week, and then I was going to try and do like a hit workout, like a hit strength kind of workout once a week as well. So we'll see how that goes. Because I mean, to do that, I'm going to have to make it up, like, like sort out what I want to do actually try it out to make sure you're getting a good workout out of it before I can actually like film it and filming it I don't know where I'm going to film it obviously I can't do it in here this room's not big enough so anyway back to the makeup just just keep adding this baby pink colour just until you get a nice kind of transition new colour Kind of thing. Right then, so the next colour we're going to go is with Make Them Wink. 
and I'm using their smaller brush. This is their Luxe Petite Crease Brush. And it's this colour here. It's like a really bright pink. So I wanted to I wanted um to do a greeny look, but I'm saving that because I really want the new Juvia's Place Tribe palette, but it's in America. And it was like gonna cost me quite a bit just to get it shipped, and I was like, mmm. Because Juvia Juvia Place palettes are cheap but amazing quality. But I've looked at it and I love green eye looks. And it's got some really nice greens in there. By the way, this pink is like paying off quite good. There's a little bit of fallout in the pan. Nothing. Nothing really bad in mind. Do you know what? This eye is always weird. I don't know if it's because I had my eyebrow pierced at some point, you know what? But it always tends to go weird, right? You can't really see it on there, but it tends to go weird here. And I've always got to like proper pick it in and sort it out. I was going to use just the white on the eye, but I didn't. I went over it with a baby pink. Because the white's not as... um pigmented like as I would like a white to be but then like white can be really awkward I'm still contemplating getting that um James Charles palette because that's got some really nice colours in there but then people are like you know some of them are like it's hard to wear with some of them I think it's great so but the, there's so many colours in it so for me it's like yeah I think I'll have to get it it's just not in stock right now so I can't have it but that's another palette that is like a good price you get loads and loads of colors and it's an amazing price right so I've done that pink I'm gonna go back over the top with the baby pink just to kind of fade it out a little bit just so it's not as harsh and then we're gonna get this little Lux pencil brush and I'm going to go in with this purple shade, which is Purple Rain. And we're going to go in the corner. We're going to damp... Bleh, I would say dampen. I thought I because I saw the purple rain. I was like, dampen. Weird. Um, I'm going to darken. I really need to sort this bedroom out. I've got all my um, my makeup and stuff all set out better over there on the dressing table now. So when I can get a ring light at some point, I might be able to actually sit down. Or at there and do it and then all my stuff's just like in front of me because at the minute I've got to put it on the windowsill and I've got to lay out everything I want to use because it's just awkward I think it, that's what kind of puts me off doing the beauty videos oh, and also something else planned as well I'm thinking about getting the loot fright crate because I like my horror stuff you wouldn't think it with the pink bloody eyes would you but yeah I like my horror stuff so um, I'm thinking about getting that. I think it's like every two months you get that one. So yeah, I'm going to get that. Right, so we've done that. So now we need to, so what I did do, zit. Um, I wiped off a bit of the pink with a baby wipe. I should really get some makeup um, cleaner for my... Get it all quicker way. It's just to get that. Because then we're going to go back in with their concealer to catch your crease a bit. Not all the way across, just I'd say about three quarters. I think I did. I think I did. It's starting to get dark in here. But then if I put the light on, it's going to look really weird. Right there. And then what I do is, I tend to tap this bit here, just to blend it in with that shadow so the, the line's not harsh, and remove a bit of the stickiness from it. And I did, I did, I'm going to do that this eye exactly the same though, because I know I did, like I said, I used a different colour, but I'm going to do it exactly the way I did it. So what I did was, Went in with the white, which is called Coconut Crush. And I went over this. 
So if you look, it's not not the best white in the world. Try patting it down. But it's not the best white, but it'll make the pink stand out a little bit better anyways. And then I got back in with this, um, the Make Them Wink Pink. And we do it here. So I was doing this, and then that's when I decided to do the, the pink in the corner rather than the white, because it was just like, mm. So much noise. So then, now we're going to go back in with Pinky Promise and we're going to just pop that there. A bit more, make them wink. purple again just to darken up I don't even know what I'm gonna do with my under at the minute either I'm just like mm, I don't know see what happened here is now as well this eye has gone more there but then this eye has not really done it so it's sometimes I'm so annoying enough to like clean it up So I'm going to clean it up and I'll be right back. Okay, so while I was away, I also put some eyeliner on. Um, this Master Ink by Maybelline. I've only done that, hello. I've only done that though because when I put the eyelashes on, I don't always do eyeliner. But sometimes if the band, I know the band's not going to like work really well with my eye, I'll put a bit of black eyeliner there and it just stops it from looking a bit weird. So we're going to put some mascara on, any mascara will do, this is just one I got out of a box to be fair. Mega Boost Lash, I don't know what it is. <laughs> I'd love to know how people do their underlashes me because it's like, I ain't really got any. And it's like you see them going, um. Oh, and the lashes that I am using today, I haven't got the box to them. Usually I pay like seven or eight pound, but I found these. Yep. And I got them from Primark for two pound. So I was really buzzing about that because it's like two pound. And they look really pretty on, as you can see, they look really nice. Only thing I would say is when you pay more money, they're more curved, so they're more easier to put on. That's the only fault I would say about them. That is it. But apart from that, they're amazing. Right then. Now my eyebrows. I don't know if I do this on camera, not to be fair. But I use the Tattoo Brow um, by Maybelline. In Well, it's Tattoo Brow bro, Brow Promade. Promade, Promade, whatever. It's not the actual liquidy thing that I used to use. Mm, no. But I do like this. And this is in dark brown. I am going to pause it here. I'm going to do it off camera. And we're back. Now I'm not amazing at eyebrows, so I have some people take ages and doing so. It's not me, I'm not that great at it. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not that great. So I'm gonna take some eyelash glue and I'm gonna stick it on my eyelash. The one, I'm, the one I've got at the minute is the House of Lashes glue. I will say though, I actually prefer the Revlon glue. Everyone's got their own. Thing of what they like but I prefer the Revlon glue so you know it's like the highlighter that I use I prefer the Asda one I mean look at that that is just like oh it's not like that. but yeah I mm. use the Asda one and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this one here which has luster and I'm gonna just pop it under there it's so pretty it's just a, such a pretty highlight I love it and I've actually got another one. My husband got me another one for Christmas. Yay! So I'm happy about that too. Because I love it. And we're going to pop some in this corner too. 
but it's only like, I think it's like six pounds, I think. And I can probably pay um, like 20 pound once for a 40 pound highlighter. And it wasn't all that great. But this lasts me all day. And it's really, really pretty. I like it. I like it a lot. So, it's ready for the air lifter. To dry. <laughs> Did you really think I was going to put my eyelash on the video? No, don't think so. And here, down to the last part now, and this bit is most probably the quickest part for me, is it's just to make me look decent and get me through the day, if I want to use it, obviously. So I'm using the Rimmel Lasting Finish 24 Hour Comfort Serum, whatever it's called, and this is in the colour... Where are you, colour? Ivory, so it's number 100. And basically, what I do is, I just pop some on my blender. I'm gonna have to get slagged off for this. Look at the stew, how she does it. Oh my God. You know, I don't really care. <laughs> I, have, I don't have time to like, if I'm gonna do a foundation, I don't have time to mess about and I don't have time to be taking hours on my foundation, on my makeup, I've got children. When I've got to get ready, I've got to get ready. And to be fair, I don't think I'd want to spend like forever doing it. I mean, don't get me wrong. Some of these women who do it are amazing and they can make their face look totally different. And I don't judge anybody, That that's fine. If they want to do that, that's fine. It looks amazing. It does look great. But well, I just personally don't have the time to do it. Like my videos. I just don't have the time I, to do it. All those videos going on for 17 bloody minutes. Ugh, this is why I don't do full makeup videos. This is why I don't do them. They just take so long and people must really just get bored and don't want to listen to my rambling on. But anyway. But I mean like that, you know, it's, it's covered quite nice. I do love this foundation. I have tried different ones. Sorry about that. My kids was just being kids. Anyway, <laughs> so I'm back. So then I'm going to get this bronzer. Do you know what? I don't use bronzer. And I only started using it recently. And I used to use like a proper contouring kit. And I just thought, you know, I've seen some videos where they're amazing and they do the makeup so so bloody great and all they use is a bronzer so all I'm going to use a bronzer this one's a Laura Geller one I actually got this free well not free but I got it in a beauty box it's really nice and then basically I just get a brush and I just put some here and it's that thing don't they like less is more so let's go with that although my eyes are really dramatic stupid But yeah, that's good. I haven't got time, so if I'm gonna get ready, I need to be quick. I've got like when I mean like when we go to a party, I've got six kids to get ready, so it's like and four of them are girls, so I don't have the time. So I like quick makeup, quick, 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 quick. Yeah, but I think it's like nice, like ninety minutes, which is quite quick because. Normally I try to get my makeup done for like 30 minutes. So like 30 minutes is like the max. I have took 40 minutes like when we've had time, like on a weekend, but I just don't have the time. Right then, so I haven't done my on dries yet. <laughs> but we're gonna go in with this highlighter now. So I just got this unicorn brush. I just got them off eBay, this is what I use. And I'm gonna go in with the one called Sunset. As you can see, it's, I've hit pan. I love it so much. But I do love this. I mean, the highlight is great. On foundation, it stands out really, really well. I'm burping. It's my dinner, it's repeating on me. I don't know if you can see that on camera. But it's really, really pretty. 
I will add a little bit of um, the luster one because I like my highlighter to be really in the scene. But usually when I go to the gym, I don't I don't have any any foundation on. I don't do my eyes apart from I'd put eyeliner on. I might do a video actually on like getting ready with you. Although it would be in the morning when the kids are like getting ready. And it's just like, is that really worth it? Mm. Mommy, 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 mommy. <laughs> okay, so this is where the highlighter gets insane because I like insane. Mm, look at that, that is beautiful. But you know, kids are kids and they do what they do and yeah. All kids have the moment, don't they, right? Right? Anyway, my highlighter is looking insane and I love it. I love it, love it, love it. I think I will quickly just go underneath the eyes. So I'll we'll grab a bit of this baby pink. Start off with. And then we're going to go in with the Make Them Wimp Pink. Oh dear. Hi! Hello! Hi! Have you lost your dummy? Have you lost your dummy? I've got you one in here. There you go. Thank you, mommy. Sorry about that. <laughs> um, yeah. That looks kind of cute. And then we'll go in with the purple again in the corner. Just darken that up. What are the eyes starting to happen? As normal with me. <laughs> Sorry. I was wondering to put lipstick on, but I think I'll just not. <laughs> My kids are messing about and I um, yeah, need to be a mom. So anyway, thank you so much for watching this video, taking the time to spend it with me to get this nice pink eye look. I would recommend it. Eight pounds of your money. It's going to last you a while as well. Bright colours. Great for summer, great for Christmas, great for anything really. I um, suppose you could use other colours with it too. Don't forget that as the highlight it is amazing. You should definitely buy that too. It's amazing. Primark lashes. Definitely a thumbs up from me. So anyway, yeah. Happy New Year everybody. And I hope you had a great, fantastic, amazing Christmas. And I will keep on top of my ch channel, I promise. Please like, comment and subscribe if you did like this video. And I will be back. See you next time.